Hey guys, welcome back to the VR Guy. And in today's video, I will be talking about Meta's next VR headset, which is called MetaQuest 3. In this video, I am going to be talking about the release date, the prices, and also other specs. Okay, here we go. Now, a MetaQuest 3 has officially launched and is available for pre-ordering. The headset will ship on the 10th, 10th of August. August? I meant October. Um, right now, if you purchase the 128 gigabyte model, you'll get Asgard's Wrath 2 for free. And if you upgrade at and purchase the 512 gigabyte model, you'll also get a six month MetaQuest Plus subscription in addition to the free game. This pre-order offer ends on January 27th, 2024. You can pre-order the Quest Free from the Meta Store in 23 countries or from selected retailers. In the US, you can pre-order from Amazon, Best Buy, Target and Walmart. And if you're a UK customer, like, like I am, we can pre-order from Amazon, Curry's and Argos. Now, let's move on to the price and ava availability. Now, in the US, the MetaQuest 3 will start at $499 for a model with 128 gigabytes of storage which is $100 more than the Quest Quest 2 and its price tag of $299 price tag. There is also a larger storage size model, 512 gigabytes, available for $649. Now, if you live in the U UK like I do, uh, the launch price will be £479 for the 128GB model and £619 for the larger 512GB model. Uh, in the EU, the launch price is €549 uh, Euros for the 128GB model and €699 Euros for the 512GB model. And lastly, in Australia, the launch price for the 128GB base, base model is €799 Australian dollars. Okay, so let's now move on to the MetaQuest 3 specs. Okay, so the the launch date is September 20, 27th uh, and the release date is October 10th. Now, the CPU is running a, a Qualcomm Snap, Snapdragon XR2 Gen 2. Uh, it's got eight gigabytes of RAM. Storage is either 128 gigabytes or 512 gigabytes. The display is 4K plus infinite display, which is two LCDs with two, 2064 by 2208 pixels per eye, which I think is insane. Uh, it's got full color pass through with two RGB cameras. The refresh rate is 90Hz native uh, or 128Hz um, experimental. Uh, the field of view is 110 degrees horizontal and 96 degrees vertical. The weight is 550 grams. Uh, the dimensions it's 144 millimeters by 160 millimeters by 98. Battery life is up to 2.9 hours. Charge time is two hours. Uh, is it backwards compatible? Yes, it is. Eye tracking, no. Connectivity, Wi-Fi 6E and Bluetooth 5.2. As I mentioned the RAM just then, um, Meta says this this gives the Quest 3 twice the graphics processing power of the Quest 2. 
Uh, the Quest 3 it, it is also g getting a RAM upgrade with 8 gigabytes of RAM instead of the Quest 2's 6 gigabytes. Unfortunately, this does fall short of the 12 gigabytes of RAM you get with the MetaQuest Pro. Okay, so let's have a look at the design of the Quest 3. Uh, here is a picture of the Quest 3. It looks pre pretty cool, actually. MetaQuest 3 has been completely redesigned from, from, from the inside out, according to Meta. While the he headset has the same overall aesthetic as the Quest 2, its optic profile is now 40% slimmer, thanks, thanks in part to pancake lenses. It also has a bold trio of, of two pill-shaped pill RGB cameras and a depth projector on the front of the headset to facilitate the full colour video pass-through. There's also a new lens distance a, a adjustment wheel that allows for more precise interpublary distance IPN fine tuning. The, the headset supports an IOPD of 53 millimeters to 75 mi millimeters. The built-in eye, eye glasses and depth adjustment eliminate the need, need for the glasses spacing insert that you needed with the Quest 2. Speakers also get a boost in, in the Quest 3. Meta says the audio range for the Quest 3 is 40% louder than the Quest 2 and that the Quest 3 produces 3D sp spa spatial audio with, with enhanced clarity and bass. There is a 3.5mm headphone jack if you want to plug in your own headphones for more, more immersive audio. In terms of the strap, the, the Quest 3 gets a soft strap included with an optional hard elite strap available for purchase for $69. This is similar to the Quest though the strap, the, though the strap design is slightly altered for a more secure fit. As for the controllers, Meta has redesigned the Quest 3's Touch Plus controllers to be more ergonomic. Not yeah. Unfortunately, the wait. The Touch Plus controllers also support true touch ha haptics, g giving the Quest 3 controllers a feature um, pe people love in the uh, P PSVR 2. This should pr provide users with a more realistic and immersive experience. Unfortunately, the Touch, the Touch Plus controllers will frustratingly rely on disposable AA batteries. However, the headset does, does get a MetaQuest charging dock for a, an additional $129. Uh, the wireless charging for the headset is facilitated by, by, by contact pads on the bottom of the headset and includes lithium ion rechargeable batteries for the controllers. Okay, so that brings us to the end end of this video. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like, that will be greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you're brand new and don't forget to turn on the notification bell. And I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.